We're seeing two roams just meet Damn, up. Team Egypt and really Alpha. popping off, huh? Amount of damage there from Aizen and Forbid. That first game was really dominant, actually. The previous one, game one on the Barretts, and now he gets his hands on the Terizla against a player who is well known for his Terizla gameplays, especially on the road here to the WEC. Aizen, a favorite of that hero, will also most likely know how to play against it, right? To the to the best of his ability. So still, Yu Zhang, one of those heroes that has, in a way, it's made strides throughout competitive MLBD, but it's fallen off to some other picks here lately. Still a great hero, though. Still great kit and option available. And well, as we see Mario rocking out the Quantum Charge here for its emblem, mostly we see use the focusing mark if you're a Kaja, but we don't hold that thought. Oh! Damage going through Egypt. Mario's still safe, though. Oh! God wow. damn! He was just waiting for that level four, able to get the decimate off. So, Martis, bro, Martis, Martis is like a big meta in ISF actually. Talking about that. I see a lot of Martis. Focusing mark or even the quantum charge right now differs a lot because right now in the minds of Mero, you want the basic hits to even rin, uh, again regen a bit of a health for you. One say, let me turn the donations off for now when I'm watching. I'll I'll explain it again. Let me do it. But now, Bro, you don't have to do anything. All you gotta do is, uh, again, when I roll it, before I roll it, you gotta type something. Yeah, you can join. There's 30 people to go. <laughs> 30 people bro that's a lot of people for this matchup you don't see too much out of the ordinary it's really just kind of who gets these numbers advantage when these fights i'm not rolling right now so you don't have to type this is really good for mongolia lasso doesn't have retreat oh wait arfo doing it arfo doing it wait 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 what messed up gonna be a trouble here Another oh wait, kill that's a kill. God damn Egypt! Oh, he's in dead. Oh! Type here, yeah. Type in the chat, YouTube chat. We're talking about this is the damage that needs to be present in the side of uh, Mongolia, utilizing that way of having a great amount of C. Rush again? Inside of Egypt. Sheesh! Bro, this this hold that guy, assassin main. Not a fanny one trick. Okay. Again, we're at a point, at least in this game number two, where it's a lot closer this early on. Yes, it's only three minutes in, but so far both sides just kind of slugging it out, right? One thing that you really Thank you, Heiko, for donation. I turned it off on the screen though. Do not get distracted. Mid to late game. Right now, with Bebex having that early kill, a little bit of a lead here, will kind of help out. I mean, both junglers are doing well. Martis is 2 0 0. Oh, he <laughs> wait a minute. Hold up. I thought he's gonna hold, but I guess not. Nice one, really told. Damn, two kills for. Oh, Mart's coming. Nice, Clint. Oh my god. Bro, Egypt is doing. Everybody expected Mongolia to kind of like 3 0 dominate, but. Completely. And I, I guess not. Just wanted to have that edge and using that ultimate right into the turret of Mongolia. Look that they know they haven't. We they haven't waited for for a bit to use that. Hold on, let me turn off my game sound. I bet. It was just a counter from the side of Egypt to use up against them, and by that it was just easy, speedy, getting the advantage to get those two kills for him. So this is the coverage now because we're talking about the damage that needs to be present in Mongolia. They they wait for someone or they, they force out someone from Egypt to make their magic work because right now forbid the Impure Age present, they have folks that, that it can be utilized across their way heading to the mid game. Oh, this is bad for Hoda. Very good zone by this Yuzong, but that's kind of dip though. Oh, should be fine. Teresa cannot kill him. Good enough to flicker, but yes. sure. What's the, the, the problem that can brew for the side of uh, Egypt? The team very, very even game, guys. Very, very even. Be, uh, a bit of a way of penetrating the Egypt is doing it. Egypt, knowing that Forbid has... 
they need to want, they kind of want to want to force out the ultimate out because there's a flicker and there's an ultimate. But by just checking on these items, this is a problem right now that they, they could actually be addressed. So they have the Ice Queen one, they have the Blade of Hepatitis for Brody. By just looking at the first item for Eve, it's an effective way of caging them in that chessboard. The one that they can utilize to, do, to get oh. items for Bebex. Divine Judgment. Nice pull by Kaja. picked off there. This is what I was talking Damn, about. Damn, both jungles doing target. good. That's what you expect. The Divine Judgment, the find its targets, even if it's the Roamer, they'll go for it. If it's a secured kill. No objectives able to take for them just yet, though. Turtle still... Arfo, my, my man! My man doing it! Boom! 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 You made a mistake! He falls under the turret! Wow. Up against Aizen, who also uses that Tarizla. Oh, Bebex will fall as well. Solid choice here. God damn, for B. Oh my god. Damn! Out easy will fall. Morrow. Can't. I don't think he's escaping this one, OSX. Now, now it's the, the tables have turned. Now the tables have turned. Marius got a kill as well, and then he's, he pushed the mid lane turret. Tabi is going to be gone. Body's going to be gone. Mongolia is going to lead from now on. They are warmed up indeed. As we see the progress of... Mongolia now it's much damn that was bad Arfo that was bad I thought he got it too but then you zone passive oh he didn't get top at least you zone passive come in still relatively even though across the board right for the most part you can see fight from both teams oh oh Maro Hakashi in question mark now looking for one more smile oh oh mid lane fast enough as he falls as well, two members down here for Egypt. Yeah, we have now magic items being, well, gathered by Forbid. And this is the problem now that needs to be, well, focused on if this is Team Egypt. Look at the early game, it wasn't a great start for Mongolia, but now they're having more items for this Eve. A lot of things that can just be a, a rinse and repeat process by just taking on uh, the side of uh, Egypt. You have the Argubi up now much more, uh, again, it has more sting, it has more damage, and Bebix right now with Damn. And Alpho. Alpho using the penalty zone defensively. Oh, nice hook, nice hook. Shut down, shut down. Yo, Clint got a shut down. So Huda does not have that, but they're able to get a kill here. Easy beauty. From Mongolia, but still Egypt holding it as even as possible as they can before that first Lord comes up. Wow. Just eyeing on on isolate members of Egypt just as this moment almost nine minutes we have ice queen one and also the glowing one present for this eve you have scorch power you have movement speed that can easily be a reinforcement once they're happy bro I, what i like about egypt is like they're they're behind after that trace but they're still like playing their style they're still aggressive they're still like from the early game we were talking about doing their thing a lot of resources over and over again yep. to overcharge Mongolia them. needs to stop bleed and then um that's what they gotta do you know if they can put pressure uh, focus the objective can, from now on whether that's in these side lanes you saw them cutting some of the waves earlier on that's the best thing they can do right now especially you can listen to my game song they oh. should be able to win some of these objective based fights right the the ultimates that they have available to them whether that's the on blast whether that's the real world manipulation from Forbid. They've got the tools, but again, they have to watch out. Oh, they fixed the minimap. Nice. <laughs> this early on, especially now that this Lord is up. Well, oh, it's an invite sound. Oh. Objective here yeah, you're right. Someone invited me. From these two. That is true. Right here. So in to the coverage, Mongolia has an edge in waiting for the right time to strike the Give away only for members, no subscribers. Any subscribers? That's. I'll explain it. Don't worry about it. No. Oh! Oh, this is good. Use on dead. Oh wait, no damage. Wait, Easy Pity was not there. What the fuck? 
Oh, he's dead Alpha still. What? Oh, he doesn't have ult. Oh, what the f... Nice. We'll miss Clint got a kill. Oh, Clint? With his own. Clint? And they're still trying to follow up on this. Ethan could Call some, show me something. He's a beauty. We'll be able to get away though. Kill him. Kill him. And he escapes as well. Three minutes. Could be a kill. No. Oh, uh, Smile oh, is still oh. looking for another way of getting another target from What? Him. That was still a safe passage. For that team to go back in the base. How many, oh. how many moments in this? That was a free lord. Away? Someone got away with just a sliver of health. It's just one. That was a free lord if we got that. Again, what the fuck? Mana? Just yet. No, all you have to do is one more auto attack. Just chase him. No. It could have been a different scenario. Hudo was there. Members of Egypt was there. But they, they wanted to have this discipline to not re-engage. Because at most of the times, they have... They're trying to feel the power spike now of, of Mongolia. And they're respecting the fact that we need to have counters. We need to have the tools for this. So, so with this kind of a, a time we're seeing on this game, it's 11 minutes. So no one is pushing top. Both the EXP laners are, I guess, uh, team fight EXP. So they want to just look for a fight here. Okay, Alpha. Same position. Oh, Brody is about to get caught. Oh my God! What the fuck, Brody position? Go ahead and reset. A big play coming through from Egypt already. Able to get the gold lane mark. Oh! Alpha. Going in with a flicker penalty zone. We'll be able to hold on just a little bit. Oh, Evolt is... Oh. As well. Eyes in there to back oh. Him up. Looking for the kill. Alpha fall. Oh, that's, that's actually Still good. Oh, why can't Egypt away. finish them off the every round. time they get away? It's still a bloodbath here for This is a free lord, though. Of the game. At least the road is evolved. Not evolved. Enhanced. So it's going to be... It's going to be jumping in the bot lane. Onto this Brody. You would want to have that damage. Yes. We were looking at Damn, Egypt is losing in gold, but they're playing like they're 10k gold ahead. The late game from minute 15 or later, you need to have the damage from a Brody to even to have it. Because that's the one who they needed to actually compensate. The yeah. they're building now they're even gold. Remember, that's what we said in the draft. OSX was with the Kaji, you always have to be worried about... If they weren't buying the gold, I think they would have killed... A lot, they would have gotten a lot of kills from those two team fights. But they were behind... It's even, right? But it comes down to those micro decisions. And the fact that Egypt was able to find Bebex before that Lord take gets the kill. You lose so much firepower. What do you mean quality? Yeah, he opted oh, shit. My bad, boys. Going for, uh, uh, again, he, he went for the Blade of Hepatitis instead of going for Oops. the Blade of Despair uh, from, from Brody. And this is one thing that he wanted to uh, have a uh, coverage on because at some points he could get pulled by Marrow and Conceal. We heard a Conceal here from, uh, yep. from Egypt. What is he pulled? Nice pull, but it's no damage. Lorita ult comes in. Clint Flicker already. No follow up just yet, though. Gonna hold them back. Easy. And the Lance is not here. Bro, you should always fight without jungler. I don't know why. This is one in the jungle. They finally take him down. The trade for one for one. Lord finally take Why they always fight without jungle? Lose that inhibitor turret in the bot side. But they're somehow winning, I guess. Feeling the pull of Eisen, which is how Body's gone. That's they good. Wanted to pull to Egypt out of the equation in, in their own team, but they wanted to take out the damage dealer right in that fight. Because as of the moments that we're seeing, Bebix now has. Remember last game? They were fighting without Fanny like three times. Damage item is securing his own way in again. Being in those Two room boosts in one. I think that's a bug. Damage. Last game, Valentin also had a room item on the top of his head. Maybe I don't know. So 14 minutes in. Oh, this even, like literally even. Relatively even in terms of economy gold. It just comes down to that execution factor. And what we're seeing both teams do is really. It's not bug. He actually bought it. Less than a minute away. So expect another conceal play to come through here. OSS. They always take two rumbles. Oh really? And it's gonna be okay. To to really this game understandable. I think Valentina yeah, Gold is yeah, pretty low this game. But available. last game I don't know. But man, right now it seems like Egypt is controlling. Are they just gonna? Do they just give the? At least picking the right fights, the right. No, I don't get it. And trying to come out winning those. So again, as we lead up into that next Lord take, you're gonna see both teams kind of just. Egypt is playing the Kaja pick pretty, pretty perfectly right now. Like if you look at Kaja, he has 100% kill participation. Everything, every kill works around him. 
ice queen wand and again the glowing wand is more like and then mongolia is pressure now more in those kind of setups that, that can be effective for the side of mongolia because so they can't really face check present in the late stage of the game could actually be again a complete rinse and repeat but much more faster for mongolia with this they need to answer a lot of damage but they need to pick who inside of egypt again Seal flank gonna be used here. Maro gonna flick her in. God damn, bro. Maro is like Ethan fucking. Doesn't care. He just goes in. But Arfo always oh, feeding. <laughs> Arfo, my guy. What happened? Pull out the brats again. Oh, Clint. They cannot catch Clint. They can't. Oh, Mongolia disconnected. Oh my god. Oh my god, Lens. Oh my god. They fall here in the jungle. Oh, 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 is it Piri? Oh, the micro from both teams. This is tough. It's a two for two. That was a complete tug of war. Just Damn. Being the end that Clint plays so well. Out a lot of resources from Mongolia. The discipline. Look at it. Looking at this reaper. Look at that. The penalty zone on to Ethan. But one of like, no need to flicker there for Arfo, the but he did it and then he got caught. But then, look at it. Mardis, Yuzon comes in. Way too far. Way too far, right? Look at this. Way too far. And then got counter engaged. But here, Lance goes crazy. Oi. Wait, what happened? Push him Lord was taken here. Ethan gonna go down just short. Oh, nice lens. There once again, focusing on Ethan. Nice lens. Bro, they want to kill this Clint so bad, but they can't. Still will be focused on Puda now looking for Orbit. Can't get the point. Hey, Butterfinger. Ethan might be next. Nice. Hold up. Show me something. Gonna be just fine. Zixora trying to help him out. Oh. Not able to get the kill. Smile will clean it up though. And the Lord was taken. But Damn, GG? Wait, how side. they got Lord? Why are we watching side. fucking replay when they're doing Lord fight? No. Are you kidding me? Defending this, but it can oh, double evil. Our WM will be the key here. Okay, ZXR are trying to keep oh. this game going. This oh, still gonna be working oh, oh GG? And it's easy. Yo, Egypt? In a sweep. Team Egypt having a great start up against Mongolia who remain undefeated. This guy.